Robert Bazell told a group of us in the newsroom today that of all the stories he'd covered over all the years he's been here, this next one has to rank as one of the most fascinating. Well, this morning we can meet a man who can remember every day of his life. He's been called the human Google. From La Crosse, Wisconsin, please welcome Brad Williams. I'm sure when people meet you all the time, they want to quiz you, and that's just a terrible inconvenience. So let's do it right now. Sure. January 19th, 2004. January 19th of 2004. Well, I think that was the uh, the Iowa caucuses, and especially the night that Howard Dean got a little carried away. What celebrity marriage took place on Sunday, October 6th, 1991? Liz Taylor's last marriage to Mr. Fortinsky. First name? Larry. What's the first day you were ever in Georgia? Uh, July 26th, 1970. So how does that work, like just producing the date? Like that was my, it's my like virgin experience ever seeing that happen. So like, what's going on in there? Zoom in closer as the clockwork <laughs> in my ear starts going. We want to know who he is and what about his brain. You're going to meet this astonishing man this morning. Astonishing. No pressure. No pressure at all. Like I can sort of imagine somebody remembering more things than me, but what weirds me out is someone being able to connect them in time like that. That's just amazing. I think memory is the single most fascinating subject there is. Period. How can it possibly work? So has this uh, done you any good? Is this knowledge, <laughs> all this stuff you're carrying around? I mean, what? besides this fantastic besides, experience. Yeah. Besides this. This is the sort of thing that happens to kids with a Make-A-Wish Foundation. They want to go to Disney World. How are you responding to all of this national and international attention? It's strange. I wouldn't have expected this kind of attention for for just being able to remember things. If you would have told me two years ago that I'd, I'd be on Jimmy Kimmel's show, I'd say, why? And mom, what did you do that gave Brad this memory? I did nothing. <laughs> I just <laughs> had him. <laughs>